Hello friends and welcome to the spoken tutorial on additional features of IPython. At the end of this tutorial, you will be able to retrieve your IPython history, view a part of the history, save a part of the history to a file, run a script from within IPython. To record this tutorial, I am using Ubuntu Linux 14.04 operating system, Python 3.4.3, IPython 5.1.0. To practice this tutorial, you should know how to use plots interactively and embellish a plot. If not, see the prerequisite Python tutorials on this website. Let us now open the terminal by pressing the Ctrl, Alt and T keys simultaneously. Now type IPython3 and press Enter. Let us initialize the PyLab package. Type percentage PyLab and press Enter. To start plotting, type x is equal to lin space inside the brackets minus 2 pi comma 2 pi comma 100 and press enter next type plot inside the brackets x comma x sin x and press enter we got an error saying x sin is not defined this is because x sin x is actually x multiplied by sin x here, the multiplication sign is missing. So, let us now type plot inside the brackets x, comma, x multiplied by sine of x and press enter. Next, let us add title and labels for both x and y axis. Type x label inside the brackets inside inverted commas, inside dollar sign, x and press enter. Y label inside the brackets, inside inverted commas, inside dollar sign, f of x. Title inside the brackets, inside inverted commas, inside dollar sign, x and x sin x. We can now see the labeled plot. The history of typed commands can be retrieved by the percentage history command. Type percentage history and press enter. Percentage history itself is a command and is displayed as the most recent command. Whatever we executed in the terminal is stored as history. If we want to see what was the fifth command, pass 5 as an argument to the percentage history command. Type percentage history space 5 and press enter. This displays the fifth command which we typed. Now pause the video here and try out the following exercise and resume the video. Find out how to list the recent commands between 5 and 10. Switch back to the terminal. Let us look at the solution. Type CLF and press enter. Type percentage history question mark. Read through the information of percentage history command. We can see percentage history hyphen n 4 hyphen 6 displays the commands from 4 to 6. Here, hyphen n is an optional argument which prints the line numbers. Type Q to quit the documentation. Now type percentage history space 5 hyphen 10 and press enter. To save the history, we use the percentage save command. Before we do that, let us first look at the history and identify which lines of code we require. 
type percentage history and press enter. The second command is linspace, but the third command is a command that gave us an error. Hence, we do not need it. The commands from 4th to 7th are required. So, we need the second command and then the 4th to 7th commands of our program. Let us save it in the present working directory. Hence, the syntax will be percentage save space plot underscore script dot pi space 2 space 4 hyphen 7 and press enter. The first argument in percentage save command is the name of the file in which the commands are saved. The second argument gives the numbers of the commands that are being saved separated by spaces. Let us now open the file plot underscore script dot py and see the contents. Let us learn how to run the file as a Python script. We use the command percentage run to do this. Type percentage run space hyphen i space plot underscore script dot pi and press enter. Here hyphen i parameter runs the code written in a text editor. The code is run within the current IPython session. It uses the variables defined interactively in the IPython session. The script runs, but we do not see the plot. This is because when we are running a script, we are not in the interactive mode. To view the plot, type show on the terminal and press enter. Pause the video here and try out the following exercise and resume. Use percentage history and percentage save to create a script that has the function show in it. Run the script to produce the plot and display the same. Let us look at the solution. We first look at the history using the percentage history hyphen n command. Type percentage history space hyphen n and press enter. Let us clear the plot window. Type clf and press enter. Now let us save the script using the command percentage save. We need the lines 2 then 4 to 7 and 16. Type percentage save space show underscore included dot py space 2 space 4 hyphen 7 space 16 and press enter. To run the script type Percentage run space hyphen i space show underscore included dot pi and press enter. We get the desired plot. Go to the previous command. Modify it by removing hyphen i in the command to percentage run space show included dot pi and press enter. We see that it raises a name error saying that the name linspace is not defined. This happens because we did not run the script interactively. This brings us to the end of this tutorial. In this tutorial, we have learned to retrieve the history using percentage history command, view only a part of history by passing argument to percentage history command. Save the required lines of code in the required order using percentage save command. Use percentage run space 
hyphen i command to run a saved script. Here are some self-assessment questions. How do you save the command lines 2, 3, 4, 5, 7, 9, 10 and 11? Percentage save, file name 2 hyphen 5, 7, 9 hyphen 11. Percentage save, file name 2 hyphen 11. Percentage save, file name Percentage save 2 hyphen 5, 7, 9, 10 and 11. Which is the command to run the script? Percentage execute the script name. Percentage run hyphen i script name. Percentage run script name. Percentage execute hyphen i script name. And the solutions are to save the commands. 2, 3, 4, 5, 7, 9, 10 and 11. We issue the command percentage save file name 2 hyphen 5 space 7 space 9 hyphen 11. To run the script, we use percentage run space hyphen i space the script name. Please post your timed queries in this forum. Please post your general queries on Python in this forum. The FOSI team coordinates the TBC project. Spoken Tutorial project is funded by NME ICT MHRD Government of India. For more details, please visit this website. This is Usha from IIT Bombay signing off.